Who might that be? It's the witch from next door. We've sold our last loaf of bread. We have, we have no, no bread. bread. Of course you have no bread. Well, then what do you wish? It's not what I wish. It's what you wish. Nothing cooking in there now, is there? The old enchantress told the couple that she had placed a spell on their house. What spell? In the past, when you were no more than a babe, your father brought his young wife and you to this cottage. They were a handsome couple, but not handsome neighbors. You see, when your mother was with child, she developed an unusual appetite. She took one look at my beautiful garden and told your father that what she wanted more than anything in the world was greens, 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 and nothing but greens. Parsley, peppers, cabbages, and celery, asparagus, and watercress, and fiddle ferns, and lettuce. He said, all right, but it wasn't quite, because I caught him in the autumn in my garden one night. He was robbing me, raping me. Rooting through my rutabaga, raiding my arugula, and ripping up the rampy and my champion, my favorite. I should have laid a spell on him right there. Could have turned him into stone, or a dog, or a chair. But I let him have the rampy and had lots to spare. In return, however, I said, fair is fair. You can let me have the baby that your wife will bear. And we'll call it square. I had a brother. No, but you had a sister. But the witch refused to tell him any more of his sister, not even that her name was Rapunzel. She went on. I thought that I had been more than reasonable, and that we all might live happily ever after. But how was I to know what your father had also hidden in his pocket? You see, when I had inherited that garden, my mother had warned me that I would be punished if I were to ever lose any of the beans. Beans. The special beans. I let him go. I didn't know he'd stolen my beans. I was watching him crawl back over the wall. And then bang, crash, and the lightning flash. And well, that's another story. Never mind. Anyway, at last the big day came when I made my claim. Oh, don't take away the baby. They shrieked and screeched. But I did. And I hit her where she'll never be reached. And your father cried and your mother died When for extra measure I had made a pleasure I said, sorry, I'm still not qualified And I laid a little spell on you You too, son That your family tree would always be a barren one So there's no more fuss and there's no more scenes And my garden thrives, you should see my nectarines But I'm telling you the same I tell kings and queens don't ever, never, ever mess around with my greens. Especially the beans.